The quarantine zone around the Asian citrus psyllid is expanding tonight. Food and ag experts added 14 square miles to that area in Tulare County and Kern County. And 23 ABC's Lauren Etlinger spoke to farmers who fear the bug could destroy their citrus crops. It's the most threatening thing that our industry has ever faced. Surprisingly, he's not talking about the drought. He's talking about these. We have traps out all over the county. The Asian citrus psyllid feeds off citrus trees, oftentimes carrying and spreading one of the worst citrus bacterial diseases called Wan Long Bing, or HLB. Citrus grower John Glass says this could wipe out his entire orchard. Once a tree becomes affected with Wan Long Bing, what the psyllid does is it transmits it from tree to tree. And once it's infected, there's no cure. It's terminal. The tree will die. $20 million of federal money will be used to treat the insect. And tonight, the Department of Food and Agriculture welcomed local residents to find out more about this bug and the dangers it brings to citrus plants. They're going to be spraying so they won't be alarmed. Let them know that it's very critical that we get this taken care of before they start spreading to our orchards. So far, the bug has been found in Wasco, Pumpkin Center, and more recently, off Fairway and Union. Officials are hoping that this sighting will be the last. Within uh, about a half mile radius from where we find the insect, we go to every property with citrus and look at the new growth. And then we also use insecticides, one that is a, a treatment of the, of the leaves to kill adults and one that can kill the immature stages. Now these Asian citrus psyllids tend to go after new flushes of groves like these trees behind me. So growers constantly have to be monitoring all of their growth. Glass says it's a good thing we're preparing before it's too late, unlike other parts of the country. Florida has lost more citrus in the last eight years than the Central Valley has because of HLB. If you're planting a citrus plant, make sure to get it from a psyllid free location and keep close attention to cleanliness. They get on leaves, um, branches, uh, they travel that way. Lauren Etlinger, 23 ABC. Now, if you see a suspicious looking bug or see some effects on your citrus plants, you are urged to contact the county so they can come take a look and an inspection is free.